And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend set, it's the Milwaukee Brewers going up against the Atlanta Braves. Ladies and gentlemen, your Atlanta And we'll be back for the first pitch right Braves. after this. Here's the left fielder, Luis Medina. Batting seven. Nice warm day here. Good baseball weather. Does that change anything, Chris, especially for the hitters? Absolutely. You feel so much more comfortable at the plate. You're not worried about you know, getting jammed on fastballs inside. Well, we'll hold that thought as that's the third out, and we'll end the inning. We go to the bottom of inning number two. We're tied. Nothing, nothing. Back at Truist Park, and now it's switch hitting third baseman Gerald Raymond. The third baseman, Gerald Raymond. The wind and the pitch. Yeah, you got that one. Huh, Back up the middle and a base hit. And the leadoff man aboard. Went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. That's about as textbook right as it gets. Got his stride Julio. load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Julio Rodriguez digs in now. Run around the move, and there's ball four. Well, a breaking ball in that 3-2 count kind of tells you that that's the pitch he has the most confidence in right now. No Just couldn't field. find the strike zone. Michael. Now the left fielder, Michael Harris. So RBI spot, but Chris, this is a guy that is not really swinging the bat all that well here. In this situation, you have a real good opportunity to get swings and misses and record a strikeout. I think you attack him in this spot. Move to second, Raymond back on a dive. Let it rip one time. Need you right here. Here's a 1-1. And there's a ball. Tough spot right here. A couple runners on. Two ball count. You can't nibble, but you have to execute and finish your pitch. If you leave something out over the plate, it's going to bring yeah, in some on, runs. Fouls one off. Two and two. Well, he got challenged with a good fastball right there. Just couldn't catch up. At the belt and fires. Swung up, belted. Deep. That one went back there. And that one's going to land not so much here, but here. He rockets one to right, and they jump ahead in the second. It's 3 nothing. pitch he wanted to hit spent on some other pitches in this at bat was very patient and it paid off welcome back top half of the third inning up now for Milwaukee for Taylor right, wall the shortstop the Brewers Taylor. in striking distance but have some work to do Boog it starts with the laid off man I need a good at bat out of him right here Smash to the left side. Fair ball. Makes the turn and heads for second. The throw in. And he starts his afternoon off right with a double. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Gerald Raymond. Now batting. Oh, Boogie consistently the hits the ball hard. Gerald. His it's exit velocity and cuts. barrel rate near the tops in the league. That one hammered no, center no. field. That's back there. Adios, Peralta. He blasts one out to center, and they add on. It's five zip. Took on the big part of the yard for that home run and just barely got it over the wall. I thought for a second he brought it back out there too. He gave it a great effort, but you know, those plays are so tough to pull off, and I'm sure he'd love to have another shot at it. Man at first, 
Gerald Raymond next up for the Braves. Well, well in their win last game, this guy came up with two home runs, obviously trying to keep the roll going here in this one. Swung up, belt it. Deep, that one went back there. And that one's going to land not so much here, but here. He blasts one out to right. His second home run of the game is 7-1. Singy, he's been red hot. Yeah, another big swing of the bat for him. Man, he is really seeing the ball well in this one. Welcome to the game. First pitch out of the bullpen, a tough one. And you know he's just trying to get one in there for a strike. And on the other side, as a hitter, it's a great time to be aggressive and let it fly. It's not what they were looking for when they turned to him, but now he's got to find a way to reset. And yeah, the batter now, Sal Fralick. Hey, plays it first, plays it first. The center fielder, number 27, Sal Fralick. The why to kick the pitch. Ground ball left side. And that'll do it. Top of the order due up in the home half of the sixth. It's the Braves seven and the Brewers one. Oh, Gerald Raymond one. the next to hit. He's not going to get cheated up there. No he's not. He's looking to do Third damage basement. with every swing Gerald. he takes. Raymond. I see it, drive it. Let's go. Swung up, belt it. Deep. That one went back there, and that one's going to land not so much here, but here. A towering home run. That's his third home run of the game. And they throw a pair on the board. It's 9-1. That's their fifth homer of the game. Man, they're all getting into the action. It's starting to feel like a home run derby up here. He's putting on quite the show at the dish here in this one, and he's just so locked in with this swing, and he's just not missing right now. A three homer game, man, it's so special. And I tell you what, it's a lot of fun watching him pull it off as well. Next to hit, Gerald Raymond. This guy has turned into now a batting. beast. Third baseman. Singh, you talk he about a guy that line. has all the skills. Raymond. The range is really good, but the arm just stands out, and he makes all the plays. There's a swing and a drive. That one carrying. Pulls it in on the warning track. is a big number. You're talking 90 wins over the course of a big league season. Extremely impressive. These guys have worked hard all year long and they're seeing the fruits of their labor. It's not over yet though. This one ends the final 9-2. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John Chambi saying so long.